Swallowed Star Chapter 431, Bypass 9 Threads 13, Your Ganwa Universe Country hasn't had any punks make it into the top 20 for over a 100 competitions, who'd knew there'd be two of them this time. Huh, M.O. So is right. There are 1,008 universe countries here, and you've taken up two slots. Around him, the Undyings all laughed and made fun of the scaled armor giant. Even though Luo Feng's performance was extremely shocking, to these pinnacle of strength Undyings in their own universe countries, he was still nothing but a punk. Didn't the Ao Gu Si planet siblings both make it to the top 22? The scale armored giant revealed a smile on his face. Ha, huh, you punk, you actually know how to laugh. It's very rare. I've met him three times during this 100 eras, this is the first time I've seen him smile. He's proud. So, of course he'll smile. The surrounding undyings were all chatting and laughing. There were a total of 1,008 undyings here and the scale armored giant was naturally sitting with those he was on better terms with. These powerful undyings, some were friends, some enemies, some with distant or close relationships, naturally they formed their own cliques and chatted. Huh, what do you all think of this Luo Fong from my Ganwa universe country? The scale armored giant looked at the surrounding undying. Reaching the space flying technique 10,000 threads to the second level, and the Nanshan armament, capable of brandishing nine blades, one dark green long hair man with a huge nose, his gaze seemingly endless like the ocean, calculated, his basics are very solid, his temperament is steady and calm, and his potential is very huge. His current strength can rank in the top ten. He can indeed make it to the top ten. Within the training space, he can definitely make it to the top five. Even if it's the true arena duels, he should be able to make the top 10. The other undyings nodded. Training, didn't exactly reflect a person's true strength. Because. This training compared to the 1v1 duel was extremely different. A spirit reader controller on a spirit weapon could distance himself and attack from far. A fighter however had to kill until he is within range and attack, also, with the automaton puppets and metal life forms and other beings that weren't susceptible to spirit attacks, it made it hard for some to unleash their full strength. Just like before, the absolute genius regarded as being able to make the top 20, the hypnotist from the Hollowing God clan, Jia Lai Shi. That hypnotist Jia Lai Shi, during his own universe country selection, he only had to look at his opponents and defeat them, it had been relaxed all this while. However during the training space, against the automaton dolls etc., his hypnotism had no effect at all, and all spirit attacks were useless. Hence, Hynidus Jia Lai Shi only ranked 189 in the training space round. Does this mean he was weak? In the plaza, over a million geniuses looked up at the screen of which Luo Foam was making his way into the first level of the sixth tower. Your Majesty, this Luo Fong is very strong. An iron-like man who was like a steel cast said softly. Beside him was the silver-armored black-haired youth, the Manka prince had ranked 18 in this round. His eyes gleamed as they stared hard at Luo Fong on the screen, saying, H.M., I admit, I made the wrong conclusion before. From earlier, the Manka prince had even said, from the looks of it, he can't take it anymore he won't be able to make it past the seventh level of the fifth tower. I estimate his final rank will be around nine or ten. Even though he's higher than me, however the training space is different from a 1v1 match. In a 1v1 match, he definitely isn't my match. I have confidence I can defeat him. He was still filled with confidence before. However now. What a strong opponent. The Menka youth's eyes gleamed like crystals, completely locked on Luo Fong, he's training the 10,000 threads. He's already reached the level of 9 threads, HM, a strong opponent indeed. 
If I want to enter the primal secret area, this Luo foam will be a huge barrier, I will definitely defeat him. Following which he clenched his fists tight, sparks of lightning flashed. Luo foam. With messy hair, bare feet, the wild youth savage Rong Jun stared hard at the screen, saying softly, he's already become so terrifying. However, no one can stop me, I will definitely become the strongest, I definitely will. Covered in a black robe, a youth amongst the other geniuses stared all at the screen, saying softly, Luo Feng. Enjoy the spotlight, just watch, very quickly, I will let you all know, that training space, is just a camel beast's sheet. I will defeat all of you. Including that death god Bolan. The elite and most outstanding of geniuses were gathered here. All of them didn't submit easily, all of them had absolute confidence and pride. However, almost all that had made Luo Feng their opponent weren't easy to mess with. He can't continue anymore. He's about to fall. Even though he's strong, however the sixth tower's difficulty is much higher by a few times compared to the fifth. Oh, he's injured. It's going to end soon. The geniuses all started discussing. During the first level of the sixth tower, the battle was already at its craziest point. Go and die all of you. Luo Fang's eyes were filled with shocking killing intent. His body was filled with blood stains, there was even a hole in his waist. He stood on the dark cloud shuttle, his movement unpredictable, producing nine images. These nine images weren't continuous, but they formed a circle, and within those nine images, that was almost like Luo Feng's absolute domain. His movement were unpredictable. He was extremely nimble. Rumble, the blood hairy mammoths engulfed the land and skies and stomped over. Their huge bodies clashing all about. These large amounts of the mammoths had their own domain. With countless domains spread out, it caused the entire battlefield to become their domain, Luo Feng couldn't dodge at all. No wonder the death god Bolan didn't even make it past the seventh tower's first level. Luo Feng thought. The difficulty jump is too much, so much higher than the fifth tower's level seven. Right. In the seventh level of the sixth tower, death god Bolan was still very relaxed. He didn't even seem to use much energy. However the moment he entered the seventh tower level one, even after unleashing all his strength he still failed. And Luo Feng could feel right now where the problem was, even though his strength had increased a lot after comprehending the nine threads. However the first level of the sixth tower was simply too difficult. Pine. A blood hairy mammoth's tail hit Luo Feng's body, causing his movement to be disrupted. The already mentally tired Luo Feng fought hard to dodge but got hit by the iron hooves around. Following which, it all became black and he lost consciousness. Genius battle, the final participant Luo Feng killed 6,892 blood hair mammoths. This was comparable to the previous ranked 2 to 6, stopping at the first level of the 6th tower. Final rank, 3. Luo Feng felt the space before him turn, and after which he appeared in the plaza. The geniuses of the human race from the different universe countries all looked over. Hmm. Luo Feng's gaze swept past them, swiftly determining the location of the Ganwu universe team and heading over. That's Luo Feng. Final rank 3, I have never heard of him before, yet he's that strong. Within this training space process, suddenly a lot of people popped out of nowhere. However this Luo Feng, he belongs to the strongest of those that appeared. Hearing the various discussions about, Luo Feng walked back to the Ganwu Universe team. Madman, you really gave me a shock, you are truly vicious. The green-haired youth windmill shouted. Luo Feng, congrats. Congratulations. The other youths that Luo Feng wasn't exactly very close to all smiled and congratulated him. After all, 
99% of these people knew they had no hope of making it into the top 1,000. Luo Feng, Rong Jun, follow me. That thick voice resounded within Luo Feng and Ron Jun's ears suddenly. Hmm. Luo Feng and Rong Jun turned to look at an area within the plaza. The 1,008 Undyings had already stood up and flew towards their own teams, of which the scale armored giant immediately reached the Ganwa Universe team and shouted, All of you head back to the living quarters. Rumble. 1,008 teams of geniuses, under the leadership of the Undyings, returned to their quarters. Skyscraper 0825. Level 1. The 1,000 geniuses of the Ganwu Universe country all stood there. Under the pressure of the scale armored giant, all of them were extremely respectful and silent. This time, our Ganwu Universe country's team's performance is very good. The scale armored giant's voice resounded within the entire level 1 hall. It was rare for him to actually praise them except for Luo Feng and Rong Jun making it into the top 100 and gaining direct entry into the core of the virtual universe company, there are three others who made it into the top 7300 and gained the right to contest for the final 900 slots. And other than these five, everyone else. Your pinnacle genius competition ends here. The scale armored giant said. Causing the geniuses from the Ganwu universe country to get slightly depressed. Even after fighting for so long, right now they were simply eliminated. You all, can return to reality now and leave here. You can also wait a while and the virtual universe company organizing team will send you automatically back to your universe country continents. The scale armored giant said, Luo Feng, Rong Jun, you five, follow me. Following which he took long strides towards a walkway. Luo Feng, Rong Jun and the other three followed. The atmosphere within the large hall was depressing. It has ended. Our journey has ended. Ha, huh, everyone, even though we've failed, we've still been offered to enter the Ganwu secret area, that's not bad too. Right. Even though I'm weaker now, I don't believe that I will still be weaker in the future. We are only star level now, the training process has just begun. There is still the universe level, domain lord and sector lord level, our journey is still far and long. Spoken well. Even if you enter the core of the virtual universe company, it's still extremely hard to become undying. And our Ganwu secret area too can produce eternal undyings. Right. Let's go, we'll go drink. These young ladies and gentlemen, all had the right to enter the Ganwu secret area. Except for a few that returned straight to reality, a large portion of them left towards the restaurant in the plaza. At this time, the 1,000 geniuses of the Ganwu universe country split into two paths. Many of them entered the Ganwu secret area. A few entered the core of the virtual universe company. How the future unfolds, no one knew. Chapter 432, Milky Way Leader The geniuses were still considered calm, the 1008 universe countries however were bustling with excitement, especially the countless citizens in the over 1 trillion galaxies within the Ganwu universe country. That was a gathering of over a million absolute geniuses from the many universe countries, in the top 20, there were actually two from their own, what degree of honor was that? We, our Black Dragon Mountain Empire actually has a genius who made it to rank 3. That's the entire universe. He's from our Black Dragon Mountain Empire. My god. Luo Feng is too, too strong. Entire universe, that's 1008 universe countries. The Black Dragon Mountain Empire was completely stunned by this piece of news, even though the Black Dragon Mountain Star Field could be considered vast and endless, compared to the 1008 universe countries, that was simply tiny. Even the Ganwu universe country hadn't had a genius make it into the top 20 for a very long time, much less the tiny Black Dragon Mountain Star Field. There probably hasn't been one in the past trillion years. Luo Feng, Black Dragon Mountain 
Luo Fong, Black Dragon Mountain. Luo Fong, Black Dragon Mountain. All of the Black Dragon Mountain's internal websites broadcasted this news day and night. Any footage regarding Luo Fong, the passion and support for him within the Black Dragon Mountain Empire had reached an unbelievable level. Even the Emperor of the Empire said excitedly, Luo Fong is from our Black Dragon Mountain Empire, he is the hero of our empire. This little starfield that wasn't even worth a mention, because of Luo Fong, gained recognition from many citizens from other universe countries. Luo Fong is the hero of our Black Dragon Mountain Empire. A news broadcast spread on the Black Dragon Mountain Island sites, the Emperor exclaimed, He's from our Black Dragon Mountain Starfield Milky Way Galaxy, I've decided, to officially give him his home, the Milky Way Galaxy, from today, he is the leader of the Milky Way Galaxy. The Emperor decreed. The Black Dragon Mountain Empire's imperial family were all prepared, in truth, the Emperor had already earlier on promised to give the Milky Way Galaxy to Luo Fong. However with the public declaration, obviously it was to raise Luo Feng's position even more. Luo Fong, to be able to gain such a reputation within the Empire, the work by the Imperial family was nothing to be sneezed at. Bastard. Brolin sat in his study, gritting his teeth hard, breaking the cup in his hands, it's over, there's no more hope, the entire upper echelon have all decided to rope in Luo Fong. The Imperial family along with the backing sacred land Black Dragon Mountain, the upper echelon all decided to use all their strengths to try and rope in Luo Fong, with his home galaxy and relationship, as long as he doesn't die, also with his rank 3 talents, he will definitely have enough power in the future even within the Virtual Universe Company Corps. Virtual Universe Company, one of the five great leviathans, even standing ahead of the other four themselves. Even the 1008 universe countries had to respect the five leviathans. The moment Luo Fong grasped solid authority, during times of crisis, the Black Dragon Mountain Empire would exhaust their resources to help him. As for that ninth Prince Brolin, he wasn't even considered amongst the upper echelon of governance, how could he sway any of the decisions by the Empire? It's over. Nulan Shan looked at the screen, his eyes unwilling, with his status as a core member of the Virtual Universe Company, the moment they discover me, killing me would be as easy as killing an ant. Seclusion. Seclusion. Nulan Shan grit his teeth, unless I become stronger than him in the future, otherwise I'll have to remain forever silent, not leaking any trace of myself at all. Since it's come to this. Nulan Shan's eyes gleamed coldly, then I will go outside the starfield to the battleground. Otherwise I'd have no chance of ever exceeding him. Nulan Shan was a ruthless and absolute person, to be able to survive 1000 life or death battles in the huge axe dojo, that was also a strong decisiveness, the moment he detected danger he left his nest. And now, he sat in a universe ship and immediately left the planet. Earth. OMG, what? Luo Fong is the leader of the Milky Way Galaxy. North America Continent, Washington Base in America, a group of upper echelons were shocked. Leader of the Milky Way. How can that be, before, the information we gathered from the virtual universe all stated that a universe-level warrior could acquire tens of planets as territory, only a sector lord could be given a galaxy as territory. According to the information, sector lords are terrifying warriors that could destroy the earth with a flip of their hands, even stars, or the white dwarf planet was nothing in the face of a sector lord. How did Luo Fong get such a gift? The upper echelon of America were extremely shocked. The five great countries of earth, even though they were grateful to Luo Fong, however they weren't like the Chinese, bound by blood ties, the other countries were actually a little unhappy, why did the leader of earth have to be Chinese? Why couldn't he be from America, or India? Of course, no one dared to voice themselves, but the news now had completely stunned them. Attention all, please allow me to explain the meaning behind the universe genius competition. A golden-haired lady said, 
Once you've heard it, I believe you'll all understand Luo Feng's current status, and what he represents. Why he can actually receive the treatment of a sector lord. Milky Way leader. Ha, huh, Luo Feng sure is powerful, old Wan, how many life planets are in our Milky Way galaxy? According the information from the Virtual Universe Network, the Milky Way galaxy has over 210,000 life planets. Ha, huh, over 210,000 life planets. And they are suddenly all Luo Fangs. Alright, fight for our Earth, he's also fought for the name of our Chinese people. We Chinese, even though we've been regarded as aboriginals, however from us a genius has appeared and made it to rank three amongst the entire universe. The five great countries of Earth, all the leaders of the bases received the news, all dumbfounded by the Milky Way Galaxy Leader News. However the leaders didn't tell the ordinary citizens, in truth, the majority of the people of Earth still didn't understand much about the universe, the upper echelons of Earth didn't want to allow them to connect with the universe that quickly either. Third Brother's improvement are really shocking. Sitting cross-legged in a cottage, the black-clothed youth Hong opened his eyes, I can't relax either, teacher sure has weird friends, an undying is actually willing to live on a planet without any technology. His gaze swept through the cottage, looking at the outside world and hundreds of km of sky. In that sky were several wild men dressed in animal fur flying about. This planet was the living quarters of an undying, the entire planet was conditioned in a very primal state, the humans of the planet all forced out their potential energies and gradually created sections. And this was the living quarters of an undying, these sects didn't even seem to know, there was an undying of the universe living here. Hong, let's go. The time sector Lord Luo suddenly appeared in front of the cottage, Hong immediately stood up and flew, sitting in a universe ship and leaving the planet. The aboriginal sects of the planet didn't even know that two strong warriors of the universe had just passed through. Not bad, I allow you to rest. Lord Wu shouted. Not enough, still not enough. Thirty has already made it to rank three, my improvement is still not enough. On Mars of the solar system, Thunder God was training according to Lord Wu's plans, improving himself. Luo Feng didn't seem to know that his being ranked 3 TD in the entire universe had such an influence, he was with Rong Jun and the other three, listening to the lecture from the scale armor giant. Tomorrow the duels to get the remaining slots, depend on your performance. Understood. You three can leave first, Luo Feng and Rong Jun stay. The scale armored giant said, Immediately the three other youths left the huge room respectfully, leaving behind only Luo Feng and Rong Jun. The scale armored giant's gaze landed on the two of them. Rank 13, Rank 3 The giant's voice was thick and powerful, that powerful pressure caused both Luo Feng and Rong Jun to barely be able to maintain standing, are you both feeling proud within, thinking you are very strong? No. Savage Rome Jun said. The training space doesn't prove anything. Luo Feng said too. Humph. The scale armored giant roared slightly, it's good you two still manage to keep calm and collected, not letting this small honor and glory get to your heads. Right. Luo Feng what you said was right. The training space doesn't prove anything, let me tell you, the top 10 of the training space, consist of two fighters and eight spirit reader controllers. Luo Feng's expression slightly changed, there were actually eight controllers in the top 10. Understand. This training space, has a big advantage to spirit reader controllers. Next to fighters. To Hynoptists, it's the worst. The giant said, that Howling God Clan genius Jia Lai Shi, Many of us Undyings have regarded him as being of the top 10, however his rank is only 189. In the training space, to be able to make it to the top 20, naturally they are all strong. However some of them in the 30 to 50 ranks, are not necessarily weak. Especially spirit reader hypnotists, 
they are all ranked above the 100s, in battle however it's a completely different story. The giant emphasized, hence you too must never get careless, otherwise, you'll be stepped on by others. Luo Feng and Rong Jun listened obediently. Of course, the training space does reflect some level of strength. From the many undyings here, watching the broadcast and concluding, Luo Feng, amongst our conclusions, you rank among the top ten. The scale armored giant turned to look at savage Rong Jun, Rong Jun, you are within the top twenty. Luo Feng and Rong Jun both remained silent. The giant looked at the two and paused for a while before saying, of course, in true battle, it depends on how you perform altogether, and also how you strategize and deal with your opponent. Anyone from the top 20 can make it into the top 10, the top 10 can still lose to anyone from behind. After all everyone's strengths are pretty close. Alright. You two go rest, you've both acquired your slots, there's nothing for you tomorrow. Get ready for the final slaughter. Even though there are a 1000 able to enter the core, the treatment within has big differences, the core itself has its lower and higher levels, just like that death god Bolan, he'll definitely be able to enter the primal secret area, as for you too, work hard and do your best. The scale armored giant said. Chapter 433, Four Great Secret Areas Luo Feng and Savage Rong Jun both walked out of the scale armored giant's room together. Luo Feng. Rong Jun shouted. Hmm. Luo Feng stood there and turned around, Rong Jun's tiger like eyes were gleaming, saying softly, Your improvement has earned my respect, I hope to meet you in the arena and once again defeat you. Defeat me? Luo Feng's lips curled into a smile, I'll be waiting. Rong Jun turned to leave after, Luo Feng watched his back as he left, this Rong Jun, seemed to be in disagreement with the scale armored giant's conclusion, he seems to have a guarantee of defeating me or something. Luo Feng didn't have any other feelings, only anticipation, one of which against a very powerful opponent, the stronger he was, the more it would shape and improve him. That day, over a million eliminated geniuses were all teleported away, the entire skyscraper 0825 had only six people left, the undying leader and the five youths. Daybreak of the second day. Including Luo Feng and Rong Jun, 7,300 geniuses had gathered in the center plaza, suddenly a formless energy engulfed the entire plaza, causing the 7,300 human geniuses to uncontrollably submit, they all looked up and in mid-air, a familiar silhouette appeared. He, dressed in a seemingly normal but actually infused with mysterious energy green armor, he had purple scales on his head, his face carrying a smile, however no one dared to actually match his gaze as he looked about. Sir Knight The 1008 Undyings all said in unison and bowed respectfully. This caused the 7300 geniuses to be shocked. The training space stage has ended, First I'd like to congratulate the ranks 1 to 100 participants, you've all gained the right to enter the core of the Virtual Universe Company. Right now, anyone who's unwilling can speak out, our Virtual Universe Company will never force anyone. The green-armored purple-scaled man's voice was light, resounding in their ears and minds. Silence. No one made a sound. Good. The man nodded satisfied. Ranks 101 to 7300, these 7200 geniuses, according to your training space performance, the Virtual Universe Company has already automatically arranged your arena duels. Continuous three victories will earn you a slot, any losers will be eliminated. 7200 people, in 1v1 battles, eliminating half every battle, with three consecutive victories, only 900 would remain. The moment the words left his mouth, a large portion of the geniuses below were suspicious. Consecutive three victories to get a slot. If two strong warriors met, wouldn't that eliminated one? Luo Feng thought, the same situation had happened in the Ganwu Universe Country selection, he and Rong Yong had met. 
Luo Feng thought, this was probably what many of the geniuses were thinking. The virtual universe company's system arrangement is definitely the best, no need to worry. The green-armored purple-scaled man said, right now, 7,200 participants will begin their arena duels. Rumble. Luo Feng looked around, with only 100 youths left, the plaza seemed empty. Within, the white-robed blood blade death god Bolan, the Manka prince filled with battle spirit, the genius siblings from the Ao Gu Si planet, almost like a meat mountain at six and tall strong-looking man with a blood axe on his back, the dream shell youth, a huge youth with a face full of fur like a bear, the seductive black thread young lady with four arms, the shy and bashful youth. One hundred people. They were all the top one hundred in the training space stage, absolute geniuses set to enter the core of the virtual universe company. These one hundred all took note of the people around them, understanding that they would all become competitors. There are seats there, you can all go watch the broadcast. The green-armored purple-scaled man pointed in the distance, immediately one hundred large chairs and several tables appeared in the corner of the plaza, on the tables were drinks and food, and the green-armored man himself sat with the one thousand and eight undyings at another spot. Death God Bolan, Luo Feng and the remaining one hundred all sat, and Luo Feng and Rong Jun sat close together, no matter what, they were from the same universe country, naturally they felt closer, what's more the two felt good about each other. Look, 3600 screens. It's about to begin. Howling God Clan Hypnotist Jia Alai Shi, on that screen. Some absolute geniuses who were well informed spoke, indeed 3600 large screens appeared in the center of the plaza, everyone displaying a different battle that was about to begin. Very quickly. On the 3,600 screens, the battles began almost simultaneously. The battle for the remaining 900 slots had begun. The victors progressed while the losers were eliminated, everything was very cruel. A youth knelt on the floor of the screen, with a hole on his forehead, his gaze dazzled, his lips moving, one could make out what he said, I can't accept this. Absolute geniuses falling one by one. Five minutes had yet to pass, and 3,600 had already been eliminated. They couldn't accept this. Naturally the eliminated people were unhappy, they had already reached this level, just a little more, being in the universe country compared to the core of the virtual universe company were two completely different things. The five great leviathans, were the true pinnacles of the humans of the universe, these absolute geniuses all considered themselves powerful, only the pinnacle of the universe was worthy of themselves. If they wanted to enter, they'd want to enter the best. After half an hour, the second round began. 3,600 geniuses, once again half fell, the remaining half proceeded. Another half an hour later, after resting and preparing, the third round began. These 1,800 absolute geniuses all wished with great anticipation, they were only one step away from victory, however there was only one out of two on every arena duel that could enter the virtual universe core, the other half were all eliminated. Luo Feng and Rong Jun focused on tens of screens at a time, to these absolute geniuses with powerful willpower and consciousness, multitasking was very easy, and the present 100 geniuses were all watching many screens at a time, however they all focused on one together. The Howling God Clan Hypnotist Jia Lai Shi's broadcast. He won. He still won the same way. Luo Feng creased his eyebrows, Jia Lai Shi's three matches, the first and second battle he didn't even move and just stood there, the opponent immediately crumbled. And in the third match, his opponent managed to barely withstand the first soul attack, however he still fell after the second. Three consecutive victories. Hypnotist Jia Lai Shi acquired one slot. This hypnotist is terrifying. Savage said softly. Hmm. Luo Feng stared at the screen, normal soul attacks are usually not too scary, however, if mixed with hypnotism, that's terrifying 
the hypnotism can make one unconsciously enter into a fantasy land, oblivious to the fact itself. This sort of terrifying hypnotism, is a fighter's natural enemy. Hmm, savage Rome June nodded. Like Luo Feng studying the soul imprint and void pagoda these two great techniques, his control of spirit energy had already reached an extremely high level, his defense was very strong too. He still had some confidence of defending against hypnotist Jia Lai Shi. However the fighters, many had powerful willpowers and states, maybe against spirit attacks they could withstand it, however against hypnotism, many fighters wouldn't receive it too well. Hypnotist Jia Lai Shi, against automaton puppets, metal life forms, Masha clans etc., beings without a soul, his hypnotism had no effect. However against others with souls, his power was huge. Shua. 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 900 silhouettes suddenly appeared in the plaza, these 900 absolute geniuses mostly had excited expressions, right, they had passed the three rounds of elimination, among the 7,200, these final 900 had made it. However amongst this group of geniuses, some still had no expressions. Just like the tall and skinny man covered in a black robe. No wonder the group of undyings concluded that hypnotist Jia Lai Shi has the strength to make it to the top 10. Luo Feng and the others of the 100 stood up, walking over to gather, his gaze fixed on the black-robed tall and skinny man. Hmm, the black-robed tall and skinny man suddenly looked over at Luo Feng. The peculiar gaze seemed to bring with it some sort of formless suggestion, however Luo Feng's willpower was extremely strong, not getting affected at all, his cold eyes staring back, almost as though a golden-horned beast was eyeing its opponent. The two regarded by the Undyings as top ten material, at this time, they couldn't wish any more to get matched up against each other. The one thousand geniuses gathered together, many regarded as top ten, top twenty, or regarded themselves as absolute geniuses, all looking at each other. Congratulations to you all. A floating dreamy voice, entered the one thousand minds, all of them realized the green armored purple scaled man had appeared before them. You all are this genius competition's most elite 1000 of the human race 1008 universe countries. Our virtual universe company will nurture you to the best of our ability, if anyone wishes to not enter the virtual universe company, you can speak now. Silence, no one made a sound. Very good. However, you should understand that there will always be competition within the universe, where there's competition, you won 000, cannot expect to all receive the same amount of nurture and resources, even our virtual universe company doesn't dare waste such valuable resources. The green-armored purple-scaled man smiled, I'll announce this. Of the 1000 of you, ranks 101 to 1000, you can receive 10 mixed elements in cash, you can enter the beginning universe to study, you can enter the core of the virtual universe company's last phase secret area. Ranks 11, 100, you are awarded 100 mixed elements in cash, you can enter the beginning universe to study and enter the core of the virtual universe companies, heaven and land secret area. Ranks 3 to 10, you are awarded 1000 mixed elements in cash, you can enter the beginning universe to study and enter the core of the virtual universe companies, absolute beginning secret area. Ranks 1 and 2, you are awarded 10,000 mixed elements in cash, you can enter the beginning universe to study and enter the core of the virtual universe company's primal secret area. Under normal circumstances, the primal secret area only accepts one genius every competition, however this batch's level is more outstanding, hence the virtual universe company's upper echelons have discussed and given your batch two slots to enter the primal secret area. Chapter 434, Position Silence the 1000 absolute geniuses were curious, last phase, heaven and land, absolute beginning and primal secret areas, just what was behind these four places, however just from the names everyone could tell, very obviously, the primal secret area was the best of the group. You 1000, there are still the strong and the weak, 
the rewards naturally will be different. From tomorrow the duels will begin, selecting the final victor. The green-armored purple-scaled man's voice was dreamy and distant, resounding in everyone's minds, the rules for the battle have already been sent to every one of you, get a good rest today. Rumble. The green-armored purple-scaled man immediately vanished after he finished, at this time the 1008 undyings began their discussions. Primal secret area, they are absorbing too this time. I initially thought the slot of that primal secret area will definitely belong to that Bolan punk, I never expected to have an extra slot. The virtual universe company, it's rare for them to be so generous. During the time the undyings were discussing, Luo Fong and the rest of the 1000 all lowered their heads to look at the screens on their wrists, on it displayed the dual rules they had received. Hmm. Luo Fong creased his eyebrows as he looked. The rules are as follows. The three round duels that just ended, of which the 900 that made it through and received the 900 slots, they will be judged according to their performance in these three rounds, the virtual universe company system will choose from these the most outstanding 100, they are, Jia Lai Shi, Ka Peng Te, La Sha, Lei Shi, Wu Te Wei Si Ku. These 100 will engage in duels with the initial 100 from the training space, a total of 200 people engaged in 1v1 battles. The victorious 100 people have the right to enter the heaven and land secret area. As for the other 900, they will all enter the last phase secret area. Amongst the victorious 100, according to the judgment of the virtual universe system, they'll pick out the most outstanding 20 and allow these 20 to battle 1v1, deciding the final 10. The top 10 have the right to enter the absolute beginning secret area. The first and second of the top 10 will also be chosen from there to enter the primal secret area. The attachment below has specific details of the battles. This rule, sure is dogmatic. Luo Feng thought, they actually let the virtual universe system pick 100 out of the 900, to battle with the current top 100. Looks like the virtual universe company has absolute trust and confidence in their system, anyway the problem doesn't affect me, I have the right to battle. How can it be this way? They don't even give us the right to duel. That's too much. This, this is overconfidence in the virtual universe system. In the plaza, the other absolute geniuses erupted in rage, the rules of this round meant that 800 of the final 1000 were immediately out of the game, not even giving them the chance to display their strengths. Naturally many of the geniuses were extremely unhappy and dissatisfied. Virtual Universe Company A sharp voice roared fiercely, Luo Feng even felt some discomfort in his ears, turning to look. Amongst the group. A 5M tall, skinny-bodied, with a vertical eye in the middle of his forehead, this youth's expression was pained, there was madness in his three eyes, raging and shouting, I have a 100% guarantee of entering the top 100, even the top 20. How can, how can you immediately rely on the virtual universe system and just toss me aside? I won't accept this. I won't accept this. Unfair. It's unfair. Beside, Others began to shout out. This way is unfair. Actually fighting, whoever loses gets eliminated, that's the fair way, otherwise we won't accept this. Immediately about ten youths from different universe countries began to shout out. Luo Feng, Rong Jun and the others on the 200 name list remained calm, the other 800 however were raging madly with the three-eyed youth, the rest of them were extremely unhappy. Shut up. What are you doing? All shut up. The distant 1008 undyings, many of them raged, simultaneously that strong consciousness and pressure extended over, immediately pressuring the 800 youths, causing all of them to go pale, all shivering, their legs trembling, pa. Finally some couldn't take it and knelt down, and later, pa. 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 They all knelt down, unable to withstand the pressure. 800 youths kneeling down. Rumble. 
1008 undyings, all of them appeared before the geniuses, looking over them. I want accept this. I want accept this. Amongst the kneeling group, that three-eyed youth slammed his fists on the ground, his muscles twitching like an earthworm, forcing his head up and roaring. Idiot. From the 1008 undyings, the scale armored giant looked coldly at the three-eyed youth. At this time, a dreamy distant voice resounded, if one doesn't accept or doubts the rules of the virtual universe system, one can choose not to join our virtual universe company, our virtual universe company will never force anyone to join. The voice resounded throughout the entire land and skies, making the expressions of the kneeling 800 geniuses change. Two, two, that's too brutal. Standing beside, Luo Fong, Savage Rong Jun, Death God Bolin and the other 200 were all shocked. He actually replied like that. Luo Fong was shocked. The 800 geniuses didn't dare to believe, the three-eyed youth too had an expression of disbelief, right, they were all true absolute geniuses, in their universe countries, they were number ones. Always sitting high on a pedestal, even the universe country leaders heavily respected him, his opinion respected by many undyings. From that youth's point of view, this rule was simply overbearing, his request should be able to be met, however the answer of the virtual universe company was that simple. If you don't agree, just leave, no one is forcing you to join. That simple. Really stupid. Among the 1008 undyings, a long black-haired undying, looking at the kneeling 800 people, saying coldly, the virtual universe company's upper echelon made the rules and decisions, do you think you little punks can actually change it? You are really ahead of yourselves. If it was that death god Bolan punk that raised an opinion, maybe it might get noticed. But that's only because he was long regarded as the one to enter the primal secret area a member of the primal secret area. An old man in a white robe covered in silver scales looked at the three-eyed youth, as for you, only the outer layer of the core, how can you dare to reject? Little punks, remember. You may be the most elite geniuses of your universe countries, however in the virtual universe company, they organize a star-level genius competition every 10,000 years, and a universe-level genius competition. Within the virtual universe company, there are countless geniuses, the strong are numerous as the wind, you all should just stay low profile, it fits you better. Going against the decision of the upper echelon is a big mistake. 1008 undyings, they were all very clear that these were all extremely talented geniuses, however geniuses normally had pride, temperament issues. And the path to the pinnacle of strength was extremely long and tedious, if one always kept this sort of pride, it was very easy to fall, hence fiercely knocking them back down was a good thing. Within the large hall of skyscraper 0825. Luo Fong and Rong Jun sat in chairs, as for the other three, they were all eliminated in the three round duels. Before, I was still a little proud, however that scene before, I understand now, in the eyes of the virtual universe company, we are only some seedlings they are absorbing. Luo Fong shook his head, the virtual universe company itself has accumulated many many geniuses. The position is not the same, naturally our words and opinions matter at different levels too. Savage said softly, the four secret areas are the virtual universe's way of distinction between their members, didn't you hear what that undying said before, maybe only death god Bolan's opinion would get some recognition. Luo Fong nodded. Primal secret area, the name list is extremely short. Savage said, the virtual universe company, such a huge power, the number of sector of lords in the primal secret area, I heard there's only a hundred. One hundred. Luo Fong was greatly shocked. Sector lords had long lifespans, even in the Ganwu universe country the sector lords exceeded a million, and the 100 to 1000 times stronger and bigger virtual universe company, just how many sector lords did they have? And the number of sector lords that entered the primal secret area was only a total of 100. 
So, you should understand just how special this primal secret area absorbing two members is. Savage spoke, the primal secret area, as the core of the virtual universe company's internal level, like death god Bolan, even though he's only a star level or later a universe level, his position is still extremely high, even your emperor of the Black Dragon Mountain Empire cannot match up to him. Hmm. Luo Foam was stunned. The position of a primal secret area member, was higher than the emperor of the Black Dragon Mountain Empire? Right. The sector lords in the virtual universe company's primal secret area was only a 100. One could easily see how special being a member was. Being higher than the emperor of a starfield wasn't strange. Also, I heard, the members have special bodyguards. Savage spoke, the leader of the guards is an undying, and within the guards there are 10 sector lords and a 100 domain lords. No matter how calm Luofoam was, he couldn't help but stare wide-eyed. Damn. Is it really true? Luofoam couldn't help but lose his composure. Members of the primal secret area having guards wasn't strange, however the leader of the guards was actually an undying. This, this, this was too terrifying. Don't be surprised, the virtual universe company, as one of the five great leviathans, even undyings, in the virtual universe company, many are mostly only in the absolute beginning secret area. Just from their position, they are much lower. Savage spoke, you should understand, just how valuable and high the position of being a member of the primal secret area is, any one of them, are extremely important elites in the company, just the resources spent on them, if changed to cash, are incredibly unbelievable amounts. Luo Foam was completely stunned. Chapter 435, First Battle When Luo Foam returned to his room, he was still disturbed, it took a while for him to calm down. Ah, that savage Rong Jun, how does he know so much? Luo Foam thought, he actually knows quite a bit about the four secret areas of the Virtual Universe Company, looks like his background isn't that simple. The two from the Ganwu universe that made it to the top 1000, Luo Feng and Rong Jun came from their own star fields. While they seem to not have any background at all. In truth, Luo Feng inherited the Yun Mo planet teachings and is also a golden horned beast. And savage Rong Jun, his true identity and background, was obviously not that simple either. On earth, Yangzhou City Westlake Courtyard, within the castle. Sitting in the tea room, pouring a glass of tea and taking a sip, his consciousness was communicating with Babata, Babata, just what's up with the four secret areas of the virtual universe company. Luo Feng told Babata everything he had just heard from Rong Jun, telling him the rules for the duel too, also about what happened in the plaza. That group of idiots, they actually dared doubt the virtual universe company system. My god, their brains must be flooded with water, the virtual universe system is a transcendental existence that can emulate the origin laws. Babata exclaimed. Oh, Luo Foam realized. Babata obviously stood on the virtual universe system side. Hm, that savage Rong Jun said the right thing. The primal secret area members have extremely high positions. Babata said, to the virtual universe company, to be able to enter the primal secret area, these are the extremely rare geniuses of the entire universe, hence they are willing to spend huge amounts of treasure and wealth to nurture them. How much? Is it as much as my teacher's wealth? Luo Feng asked. Luo Feng, you have to understand one thing. Babata said seriously, your teacher was indeed a very powerful undying, even the Black Dragon Mountain Empire had to lower its head in front of him. However, your teacher, compared to the Ganwu Universe country, was a completely different level. Luo Feng nodded. Ganwu Universe country leader, that was an ancient being that had lived for trillions of years, creating and opening an entire universe country. The leader of the Ganwu Universe country, has to show respect to the virtual universe company. Babata said, 1008 universe countries, 
who dare offend a virtual universe country. That's the true huge power. Such a huge powerful existence, nurturing geniuses in the primal secret area, they have very strict plans, numbers extremely small and pitiful, the wealth that they actually spend, do you think your teacher's wealth can compare to that? Luo Fon was silent. You vision must be broader. Look further, don't limit yourself to the Black Dragon Mountain Empire, or the universe countries, but look to the entire universe. Actually I've known, since the day you possessed the Golden Horned Beast successfully, your path would be even further and brighter than the path of your teachers. Babata said, of course, from what I know getting into the primal secret area isn't the end of it, but comes with a lot of competition. The weak will be kicked out, and those in the absolute beginning secret area, the absolute geniuses within might rise up to the primal secret area. Hence, to enjoy the most pinnacle of resources, you have to constantly work hard. Because in the future, there will be a large amount of absolute geniuses eyeing your position, the moment you relax, others might catch up. Luo Fong could feel hot blood rush through his veins. Anticipation Yes, that was the life he wanted, the strong rise while the weak fall, just that simple. Babata, I don't understand too well now, the primal area members, just the star levels, they are able to get guards, and the leader of the guards is an undying. Luo Fong said, no matter how it is, that's an undying, a great undying. Yes, undying are great. Babata said. However a primal area member is also a great being itself. Luo Fong, I'll explain it to you this way, Babata said, what determines the level of position, isn't just strength alone, it depends on many factors. Like the virtual universe company's business division, some of the business geniuses or investors, their strength may be very low, however they still enjoy an extremely high position, just like the investor genius in the universe first bank, Feite, he invests with unbelievable amounts of wealth, even though his strength may be weak, but he still has undyings to take care and protect him. Luo Foam was shocked. Same logic. Just like that death god Bolan, right, he's very weak now. But you have to understand, he's an absolute genius, the pinnacle of the human race in a trillion years. One only appears every trillion years or so. And a trillion years is akin to a sector lord's lifespan, 1008 universe countries, every universe country has over a million sector lords. You calculate, how many sector lords are produced by the entire human race over a trillion years? Luo Fong held his breath. That death god Bolan, in terms of value, position, one can only imagine. Everyone who enters the primal secret area are all the most important elites of the virtual universe company. That's their root. Babata exclaimed, comprehension of the origin laws, is easiest during the sector lord stage. And during the difficult star level stage, the death god Bolan already has such a level of comprehension of the space law, think about it, how high will his achievements be in the future? No doubt about it. As long as he doesn't die. In space origin law itself, he will definitely exceed your teacher. As long as he becomes an undying, he'll be the pinnacle being even amongst the others, almost invincible. Babata exclaimed, and the space origin law, as one of the two hardest origin laws, if he can become an undying, that would be terrifying. You have to remember, even amongst undyings, the differences are huge, hence that time sector lord had such ambition. However he didn't succeed, if he did, and became an undying. His strength would be close to your teacher. Of course. The virtual universe company core is separated into four secret areas. From high to low, primal, absolute beginning, heaven and land, beginning phase. Many undyings are in the absolute beginning secret area, don't bite off more than you can chew, if you can enter the absolute beginning secret area, that would be considered a success already. What's more, your most important task right now, is to settle your first opponent Wu Te Wei Si Ku. 
Luo Fong lifted his tea cup and drank it all. Wu Te Wei Si Ku, that was his opponent tomorrow. Daybreak of the second day. Plaza, the one thousand geniuses gathered. Luo Fong was mixed in the crowd, looking at the distant tall three-eyed youth, those three eyes were gloomy, obviously the blow he suffered yesterday was huge. Sir Knight. The distant one thousand and eight undying bowed respectfully. Hmm. In mid-air far away, the green-armored purple-scaled man nodded, then turned to look at the one thousand youths, speaking, Today is a good day, we will, in one day, pick the top one hundred, top ten, and first and second from the one thousand of you. Are you all ready? Then the battle will begin now. The green-armored purple-scaled man surveyed the crowd, with a wave of his hand, one hundred huge arenas appeared above the plaza, at the side of each arena, a black net covered and surrounded them. Simultaneously, Rong Jun, Jia Lai Shi etc. and the two hundred youths were transported into the arenas. Every arena had two people. Immediately the undyings, along with the participants that didn't qualify, all turned to watch Death God Bolin's battle. In one of the arenas, was Luo Fong and Wu Te Wei Si Ku. The silver-white arena, had an area of ten square kilometers, the black net covered the entire arena. Madman Luo Fong, from the Ganwu Universe Country Black Dragon Mountain Empire, rank in the training space 3, displaying madness with extreme calm, hence the name. A skinny youth with completely black lips stared at the distant Luo Fong coldly, shouting, my rank in the training space was 113, I will let you know, that the training space didn't stand for anything. Cut the crap. Carrying the dark golden long rod on his back, Luo Fong stood on the dark cloud shuttle and floated in the distant air shouting back. Very well. The skinny youth smiled, I'll settle you and I'll be able to enter the heaven and land secret area. Then I'll settle another and I'll enter the absolute beginning area. Who? A gust of wind blew, the skinny youth became a gust of wind and headed towards Luo Fong, seemingly slow but actually extremely fast. Luo Fong stood on the dark cloud shuttle and surveyed his opponent from mid-air, details of his opponent flashing in his mind, Wu Te Wei Si Ku, nicknamed Gale, uses a level 5 genetic energy weapon Void Shadow Blade, during battle his blade moves extremely quick, mixed in the mad winds, extremely fierce and swift, hard to block. Go and die. The skinny youth's eyes gleamed. Xiao. 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 The originally wind like skinny youth suddenly increased his speed, simultaneously, the void shadow blade in his hand became a fierce engulfing gale, endless blades gathered together to form a mad wind that engulfed everything. This mad wind blade dance surrounded even Luo Fong allowing him no space to dodge. Humph. Luo Fong snorted. Standing on the dark cloud shuttle and suddenly becoming a mysterious trace, in that seemingly overwhelming blade wind dance, he found an opening to slip through, leaving nine images behind, causing the skinny youth's expression to change, he can even escape this, the information on the nine threads is indeed terrifying. In the time Luo Fong took to dodge the attacks, the dark golden long rod on his back shot out five golden lights, forming five golden blades in mid-air. Go! Luo Fong stared coldly at his opponent, as though he was staring at a dead person. With the golden energy flow wrapped around it, the five golden lights became like five golden dragons roaring towards the center of the blade wind dance, the skinny youth. Go and die! The skinny youth's expression struggled, his eyes filled with a sense of longing. Xiao. He waved his hand and shot out a white light, the white light immediately pierced through a 100m of distance, almost reaching Luo Feng, it was even faster than the golden rainbows. Luo Feng's expression changed, 
quickly relying on the Dark Cloud shuttle's fast speed to dodge and simultaneously unleashing 16 shields.